There's loads of robots in here, though, so there's probably loads of robots to use to get past the um, the things, right? Loads of attempts. Because we haven't, we, you haven't got no ability to um, shoot or anything, so we got to jump and dodge these things. We got ten health as well, so it's like you're hit by one thing and you're probably dead. Yeah, sure. Ah, okay, that's why she's there. We go back to that one. That's our default when we go back to it. Okay. So what you got to do is get to that second half of the room, and you can you can um, um, jump into the um, the stormtrooper at the bottom. The first time we did it quite easily, but the second time... Ah. Yeah, yeah, we just run out of robot now. We go back to the out the shell in that room. Ah! I can't get to the other side of the room. The first time I did it without any trouble at all, but then the, the subsequent five times I can't even get halfway. Now if we die here, we'll wait for him to come back this way, and if we die, we can also, we can just run over to the other side of the room and just jump into him. Although I think we need to get to the top, right? There we go. So I'm guessing because the thing's in front of this, it's kind of telling you to go to that door, right? Although I want to see what's down here, I'm, I'm going to... And what's actually in here? We can always come back out. Oh, well, that's another... Ah, okay, so this is... The... When you see these rooms, this is other rooms where you can actually get your, um, get your save on. Or checkpoint rooms. They're like, they're kind of like checkpoint rooms. Hey, Ellen. Oh, you didn't see me, did you? We're hiding. We was hiding, he didn't see me.
Got him. Only floss the teeth you tend to keep. Oh. These guys are a one, what? So, so technically, if the rules if the rules were to be abided by, he couldn't shoot me because I was a free and he was a one. So of course that has bollocks. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> we need to get up here, we're gonna die. I'll hit him once. No! Ooh, we dodged him! Now please stay dead, please stay dead. Supposed to, yeah. So we gotta hope this guy respawns, right? No shit. No, we don't need him to respawn. If we can get up to the top, we can just. And we can just teleport up here and just go like that, right? Shit, we just didn't get. It, the thing didn't move quick enough. I was just gonna try to cheat and and teleport to the guy at the top end, but you couldn't get up there quick enough. And now all those, everything's gonna be. Back. God damn it. Look, this, the guns are not back yet. Thank God these guns don't come back, because that would suck if they did. Right. So this isn't going to be so bad. We jump up here, he'll shoot us, we'll take the next one. He'll shoot us, we'll take the next one. Or we'll just let them shoot each other and then we'll take the next one. Now we'll take him. Alright, okay, we got the next save room. Did I? Oh no, it's because we got to the room, okay. Alright. So we're back as three stars again. It's been quite a few away and quite a while since we had a um a um oh shit. So we got another checkpoint room here. Okay. I think I'm gonna leave this guy down the bottom and just use these two at the top to kill each other. Oh for fuck's sake, I can do it in time. I was going to try to get to the t let the two at the top kill each other and then use this take the stormtrooper up because those t those other ones are a bit too slow. You're not even going to shoot. Okay, we'll go through this guy. I almost forgot he, sh he had a shield. Ten health. I remember he had a shield at ten health. Oh shit! I'm waiting for the shield to recharge. Shield again. Come on, I'm waiting for the guns to appear. There we go. Yeah. This guy's a badass. Now, well, Kyle. Woohoo.
Alright, we're gonna take that guy now, I guess. Is the guy just to the left, right? Shit! Wow, for fuck's sake, I didn't need it quick enough. Yeah. No again! Go, go all the way back! And this guy's so far getting slow. Oh, this one doesn't have a shield. Oh, he just, he's got a directional shield. Sprint, man, come on, sprint, faster. You really like the shield against the enemy? Like the, yeah, that, that other one had a shield that bounced it, a shield all around you that, that projected it. This one's actually just got a, a positional shield you can put, you know, you can in any direction, but it only stays for us, look, it only stays for like one hit. So you'd have to time it perfectly when the other one lasted a couple of seconds and just deflected everything. So we gotta go up. Let's go get this guy again. What? I pushed the fucking button, you piece of shit. At least this guy's quicker. At least this guy's quicker, we can just roll all the way along there. Alright, got him. You have to be right on top of that one. Let's try and go through this door first. There's a guy out there. I can wonder if we gotta take him. Or maybe we gotta get him to open the door, maybe? Hang on. Let's try. We'll go back to the one with a gun. He's only got 20 health. The other one would have probably been better because they got more health. But we still haven't had a um, had a checkpoint room for ages. There's one. Thank God for that. We got a room with a checkpoint. Checkpoint found. Okay, so we've got the checkpoint here now. No, right. it almost did. So you gotta get all the way over to the edge there and then go to that guy through the wall, I guess, right? This isn't gonna work. <laughs> ah, okay. I guess it could. Oh, for fuck's sake. Denied your refund request. What's that for? Is that for like uh, Dead by Daylight? You were saying. I mean, I, I've not had. To, I've not been able to do many re refund requests because I can't do it on my account. I can only do it on uh, my second account, um, and I've not had them rejected. I mean, does it give you any reason? Does it tell you why it fails, Mammon? Out of curiosity. Does it kind of tell you why it rejects you? Wait, this doesn't look good, does it? You're kidding, right? Oh, for fuck's sake. There's only one here you can actually get. You played for longer than two hours, well. Yeah, I suppose so. Yeah, we know that. It's um, you only it, it's only less than two hours, isn't it? So, that's your own doing, man. <laughs> so we gotta we gotta roll over here quick and then jump. What the fuck are you supposed to jump up? Do you know we gotta wait for that guy to respawn? Obviously, we haven't, have we? We can just jump up, maybe? 
Can I jump up here? Yeah, okay. Thank God for that. So that's, that's, that's kind of a bit rough, because you can't you can't um, shoot these things. And this thing here just under my cursor, when you go to hit that, it triggers the um, this beam to shoot. And it shoots three times before it stops. So you got to roll twice, then jump. Whoa, whoa. Aye. Aye. It's close. We've got to do that more than once. Alright, okay. Mark. You got to do it twice. This thing's only got 10 fucking health. I mean, what the fuck? You got 10 health. Right, you gotta go, um... Is that it? We got any more? I don't think we got any more. I think we're done. Shit! Quick! We got through the door, fucker! Oh my god! We was through the door. She can't get through the one. the animation to go through the door that takes about half a second and you can get shot while the animation's playing and that sucks. That kind of sucks that you can kind of get caught in the animation. Get in there. Thank God for that. as well now. Fuck off. <laughs> and every time you're coming all the way back to here. What? Does the advice city and Max Payne to work total playtime over five hours? Lol. Yeah, I think that's, that's one problem with their two hours thing is, is you know, it, sometimes it can take a while to get stuff working properly. But let me put it another way. I mean, you do get the option, or at least you have the option to do it, right? I mean, you know, at least you do get the option to um, refund, which you never had to, you know, you didn't necessarily be able to in the past. Right, so what do I got to do here then? Is we gotta go. We can't go down. We gotta jump into that hole over there. So we gotta go over, go past two, follow this thing over, jump over two, and then drop down behind it. So we gotta follow it closely. All right. That part there, you couldn't actually progress past it without doing it because you couldn't get past that block until it was shot. And my guy didn't have a gun, so you had to do it. You've got to fail once just to get the, the thing out of the way, right? And that kind of sucks. If that thing's back there when we get back, then of course you can't do it. I'm sure it won't be, but if it is. There's going to be a whole stack of robots over here. And hey, Dad. Right. Oh, for fuck's sake, it was too close to it. I couldn't, um, I couldn't drop down the hole. Ah, uh, 
He got stuck. This is a bit shit. This is a bit shit. You know, you're having to replay so much of it just to, um... I mean, you got to be like pixel perfect with your jumps and stuff. Alright. So now the thing's gone, so we can actually go there and jump over. So if we jump up there, yeah, okay, so we can go up here. And we don't want to go up there, do we? Or do we? I don't know, I'm kind of. We can't go through that door, so we gotta. You gotta time dropping down so you don't hit a beam. You, you are you fucking kidding, right? I mean, what? All right, let's do this. Yeah. Checkpoint. Yes. So we gotta... We just about made it, holy shit. Oh shit, he's got a freaking... I like that. Alright. Oh, bollocks! Balls. Is that gonna be? Now, well, so what's same thing in there? If you look there, we got the you've got the if the um craze there, we can't pick those up. You know, you can't you've got to get those to you've got to get the thing to shoot at those. You cannot pick those up, do anything with them because you know, I can't you got you can't punch, you can't do nothing. So, I've got to what you got to do here is you got to walk into the thing and die. Just so that you can, um, it can use them. I mean, how shit is that? We better shoot them and just go again, right? Because you don't have any, you got unlimited lives, kind of thing. Unlimited retries. Hello, guys, me to put some salt on a popcorn today. for nothing of it at the time, but after she'd finished, there's a bag of, there was an over a mug of salt at the bottom. Hello. Low. She only shot one of them. Fuck. So I gotta die. I gotta go in and get shot again to shoot the other one. I don't think. I'll try and jump over it. I don't think we can. Now, Ghost will be able to jump over it in her normal skin, but not in this pissing thing. We might be lucky. Oh, hello, you fucker. I should have shot it. Yeah, the checkpoint's only one room away, so, which is not so bad. I, you know, I don't mind dying to do this bit because the checkpoint's just next door. It's just like one room. Now, it's when we find out that the next checkpoint is like two rooms away. And here, look, we haven't got the guy with a gun, so you've got to get through here without. You know, I don't have a, I don't have a gun. Fuck. Fuck. 
Rolling, rolling, rolling. So, okay, down. Down to level four. How far we gotta go down? Uh, look, we're at the bottom. And we've got a checkpoint room. Is this the bottom? The, the end, maybe? Alright, okay. Oh, fuck. So we gotta go and up, jump up quick. So we gotta roll under here. That thing will trigger. We gotta jump up quick. I mean, there's no way you wasn't gonna die there. You was. You know, there's nothing you could do but not die. Hey, Draven. I mean, this game is kind of, you know, it's it's impossible to do past this without dying. It's just it's just not possible, right? Right, so there's a door up top. I guess that's where we gotta go. Yeah, we're gonna go up top to probably to unlock that door there. At least we've got a gun. But because we're only a little one star, we only have the, a pistol. Ow! Oh. Ball bags! Ball bags! See, now we're going to like two or three rooms to get to a checkpoint, so it's more of a pain in the butt. Alright, so if you're looking, looking at the pattern of this, we've actually got to walk through it when it doesn't have to beam up. Or roll through it when it doesn't have to beam up. But wait for it to come back. Ready? Up. Oh. As soon as I hit this, this thing's going to start shooting, isn't it? Yeah! Checkpoint Charlie! Well, maybe not Charlie. Oh! Shit! Gun. But it's okay, we should have a stormtrooper in here. A trooper in there just next door. He was, he was a two star. I... Oh, what? Oh, fuck. Oh, you, okay, yes, but we can't, we're not supposed to get past this. First, you jump into the, the free star, dude. Hey, Lucifer. Get your shoes back, says the Lucifer. We just wait until we die and we just go over and. Ah, that's better. Look at me. Ah, look at the. Hang on, what? Look down the bottom. What the fuck? <laughs> right? What the fuck? Hey, you kill the Traven. So we've got to jump down quickly and then when this beam goes down, I, I don't know where the safe point is. We've got to jump all the way over into that best part over here. This little uh, gap here while the beam is down. So I jump down and run over there quick. Ah, that's not how you run over there, dummy. See, now we're going, this, this guy's even slower. Oh my god. Uh, 
No, we still got to go out there to get right. We're focusing on school. Ah, cool. Well, school is very important. So I, you got to jump in that little gap, but I'm not sure how because you, we can't control our drops like you can in um, with the main character. Hey, just about. Fuck. But now we got to jump up there and do the same again? Are you... How the fuck? Right, so one, if we can get to that next one, then what you got to do after that, you got to drop down and run all the way along the bottom and jump up here before it gets back down. That seems a bit... I don't know if we're actually able to do that. I don't think we can run quick enough for that. We must be able to, right? Yeah, oh, perfect. So we missed a jump. You like them codes? Ah. Shit! Fuck! I, f I didn't realise there was a thing there. It's starting to get really fucking annoying. Just saying. It's starting to get really fucking annoying. It may well not get finished today. But if it doesn't get finished today, then I probably won't finish it. Oh shit, back, back. <laughs> I remember to crouch, I wanna go up there. Alright, so now we're gonna drop down here and go all, run all the way along there before. Uh, I don't. Uh. That is, look, you gotta do this part now without fucking dying once. <laughs> I'm not sure how far he rolls. If I do a roll, I'm not sure how far it's going to go. Let me just try to measure it. So is that... Hang on. If I, I'm trying to think. If I do a roll to get through those three pipes, will you? Will I land in... Will I stand up in the gap, or am I going to stand up um, in front of the pipes? If you know what I mean. I'm not sure. Ah, oh, good. Thank God. Two, two. Give me a, a checkpoint. Holy fuck, there's still not a checkpoint. I mean, there needs to be a checkpoint soon, right? Because this is just... If I have to do that again, I'm going to scream. Well, maybe not scream, but I'm... Checkpoint, please. Yes. Yes! Checkpoint! Can you roll off that ledge? I don't think you could. Um, maybe you could. Now oh, we're good. We're good now. So where's that stop? Right there. Okay. So we've got to jump, run and jump underneath. 
when he goes back. Roll right through him, man. Hang on, have we got any traps down here, I wonder? Sure. Fuck. You gotta, we gotta go and click that button to, um... To, um, open the door. Stay dead. So at least, at least, unlike the main game. In the main game, when you when you kill something in the main areas, and when you kill something after like 30 seconds, it it respawns. You get a robot come and, res and make it respawn. But I'm very glad that doesn't happen here. And we're gonna turn that way. So when he's so we come out, we're facing that way. Okay. Okay. We're getting there. You know, this section is much more bearable just because we're in a we're in a stormtrooper rather than the normal robots. There's level five now. I mean, how many levels are there? Did the thing stop at all? No, you gotta hit a button. You can't get to me, man. I'm through the other side of a wall. I gotta go kill this guy, haven't I? Because you need—I need one of those engineer type guys to use the switch. So we gotta kill the. Um, I mean, that's kind of shit, but you gotta—you gotta do it. You've gotta um, kill the stormtrooper and then go back, all right? And do it again. All right, so what I gotta do there is you, before I kill my storm, you gotta—you gotta kill their guy um, before I get rid of my stormtrooper because you're gonna need him. You gotta kill the stormtrooper. Is he still dead? Yeah, he's, he remained dead. Thank God for that. Play some Overwatch while you're in the stream. It's high noon. Maybe we can. Maybe we can make you fool you into thinking someone popping ultimates, for Lucifer. Maybe. It probably won't work, but maybe. All right, checkpoint. It seems weird here. There's a section on the top there that, um... There's gonna be a switch up here or something to use to turn the beams off, right? It's gotta be. Nope. Alright, you probably just gotta use your teleport into the stormtrooper. We're just gonna run into the, run into the beam. Try to get there in time. Yeah, okay. And that guy down there will be able to come and turn this off. To get into that door. So if we jump him all the way over here, and then we'll get into that guy, and then we can go and turn the switch off and get in the door. Or I'm going to turn the switch off, then go back and get the stormtrooper, then go in the door, because then we will have a um a gun. Because you don't get here, because at this point you have to die, right? There's no there's no way you can continue here because I need to get the other side of that door again and I can't because I'm there's no robots there. So this at this point you have to die and do all the previous couple of rooms again just to um get through it. It's kind of shit.
Are you going to come back in here just so we can, you know, get a robot on the other side? Hello, mate. Maybe I shouldn't have done that because. Oh, fuck. If I didn't kill him, there would have been two of them there, right? Hey, follow fashion. Time to see part of absolute hell level. Ah, cool, man. Cool. Close. Hey, next check one. I mean, how many more buddies we gotta do? Jesus, right? How many more? We need the other droid. You need one of the the um. Uh, so again, we've got to go here and we've got to kill ourselves and and start again because we need a different droid type. Because only this type of droid will, will, is able to use these switches. Oh shit, I watch a four as look. I mean, so technically, this guy here, you can drop down there and try to shoot stuff. Let's see what's through this door. Um. I think I kind of want him. Fuck! Balls! Because he's got a bigger gun and a shield, he could just drop down and um, go in the other room, drop down and just massacre everyone by dying. Otherwise, you'd have to take like two, at least two or three different stormtroopers and you know different lives to do it. But now we haven't got no stormtrooper. We've just got him. Is 
he got a shield? Oh, he's got, a, he's got like a stealth mode. And what is that other weapon he's got? Oh! Let's, let's go to his... His, um... Stealth. So basically, we got a, we got 250 health. We're going to drop down and then shoot everything. Ready. Yeah. And I should open both those doors. Cool. So technically, we could go back and get the um, other robot now if we needed to. Now we're going to have to because he can't go up fucking ladders. He can't go up a ladder. What a douche! We'll go get that dude. I hope this guy doesn't shoot me as I, as we change. Fuck! That was on zero. That was on zero. <laughs> that was close. So there's three guys guarding this door, so... There was three guys guarding that door. Ah! Oh, come on! No, not a boss! Not a little mini boss. This is like a boss room. Oh my god. I don't... This is like fucking Donkey Kong. And of course, you get hit by one thing and you're dead. Because there's no, um, you get so little health. But at least seeing the boss room means we know we're at the end, right? We're at the end. And the checkpoint is just outside, thank God. This is gonna suck. Want to buy more health? I've got 20 health, that is it. I mean, you're, you're fucking kidding. I've now more shots. We've only got one rocket shot. You could use the second one, right? Just keep jumping. His head, he was, I was underneath the, um, the little lip, I couldn't jump. Nah, you can't. You gotta kill the boss. And we got him down to about halfway. It's just a matter of jump dodging, isn't it? The freaking shit. We're down to two health already. I mean, the barrel is quite. I mean, I, f I was thinking at first that the. I mean, the barrels do help if they touch you. I thought there was exploding barrels first of all, but no, he's just throwing them randomly. So you, if they touch you, you take you lose eight health every time you get hit by one. Um. Yeah, and you got twenty health. You can get hit by four barrels and you're dead.
I, I don't think they're about hide. I mean, maybe when he's shooting a barrel, you can. I mean, you can't really hide from him. you got to kill him, right? But I don't think you can sit under... If you drop underneath him, maybe you better avoid the barrels, maybe? I don't know. Probably not, though, because he's just lozzing him out across the room. And it just shuts your shoots where you are, so if you get the closer you get to him, he's just going to shoot. You know, he's just going to move over the other side, so... And unlike Ghost, you can't shoot and move at the same time. So he's got this fucking thing as a shield. Fuck off. Um. What the fuck is he supposed to do there? When he gets down to like 200 health, like a quarter health, he just um, has that, you know, holding shit to shield in front of him. I can't even get near him. But you can't shoot through that, um, that this rubble he's holding. But we got his health down a lot quicker just by standing underneath him. Oh. Because while he's moving across the room, he wasn't shooting at least, so... I didn't have a hundred health. Yeah, there is. This this wall a wall here where my cursor is. You can't progress until you kill him. It's, it's like a boss level. At the end of each each level or each section you get a boss. Um I mean, you, you, getting near him, you can actually take his health down quicker, but you can't avoid the barrels. You cannot avoid the barrels if you're anywhere, if you're anywhere near him. And then I can't avoid the barrels when I'm far away from him, let alone near him. Yeah, when he holds his shield, you have to go under him, or at least move to the other side of the room so he moves, so he moves back, right? Oh, that's like six health. How can you how can you avoid the, those things? I... I mean, I he throws them directly at you. I I I don't see a way to avoid them. I cannot see a way to avoid them. I mean, even there. I mean, I stayed the other side of the room to where he was, and I still couldn't avoid the barrels. They still hit you. I just couldn't avoid them even across the room. I mean, like, what the fuck? I mean, you got to get close to him to make him move, to give you a chance to shoot him. And as you're close to him, he's just shooting barrels. I mean, how do you avoid that? 38! Oh my god! It's impossible to avoid those fucking barrels. I think it's luck, because there, he had two sections there where he dropped a bunch of barrels, and when he did that, you've got time to shoot him and actually um, avoid them being dropping. When he just throws them one at a time, they're very, very hard to avoid. When he throws them one at a time. Nine health. Boss defeated. Hey, where's my loot? There's no loot. You got no loot. Where's 
my loot, man. Hello, Operations Chief. Or should I say, Jacker? Ghost? Surprise! How have you been? Did you come to kill me? That's an interesting way of saying hello, it's good to see you again. Tell Victor I have information. If something happens to me, he'll regret it. Victor isn't my boss anymore. Jacker, I'm here to take you home. What? I thought you- Boogan is waiting for us outside. Boogan? Is here? Yes. Come on, let's go. Nakamura is coming for you. We have to leave before they arrive. Now they're gonna fight all the way back out for everything. It's good having you back. I can't believe Victor would go that far. Kidnapping me? After we're done with Nakamura, he's gonna pay. I don't know. This is getting too dangerous. Maybe we should quit while we're ahead. Boogan, we are so close to reaching our goal. We can't quit now. So Jekka was a loop. Hey, what if something like this happens again? We were lucky to have Ghost around, but what if Victor targets us again? Th that reminds me, how did you convince Ghost to save me? Uh, that's the weirdest thing. She was the one that did everything. I was terrified and didn't know what to do. She figured it was Victor who was responsible, so she made a plan and broke in to rescue you. I just drove. Seems like a computer just disobeyed its boss to save your skin. No. What if this rescue was just a trick to earn my trust? What if Victor planned the kidnapping and the rescue? What? But why else would Ghost have saved me? Where's the logic in betraying a boss to protect a client? Maybe Ghost was pretending to help us. Maybe Victor wants something from the Nakamura space station. Jesus, I can't imagine a person being more paranoid. Victor's twisted and cunning. Hello. We can't underestimate him. Jacker. Just talk to Ghost before assuming the worst. Hi, Ghost. Thanks for helping... Well, for rescuing me. Ugin tells me you were the one that did everything. Hey, Meridian. You're welcome. But don't believe everything. You know he tends to exaggerate. <laughs> yeah, I know. Ghost, you know that Victor won't be happy about this, right? I mean, you're going to be in serious trouble. A normal boss would fire you, but Victor's hardly normal. Yes, I'm aware. I know perfectly what I did. Then why did you go against his orders? He's your boss. I'm just a customer. And recently I've been... somewhat harsh. You could have just left me there. You didn't gain anything by letting me live. Why did you rescue me? When I first took this job, when you were pretending to be some kind of spy agency, everything felt like a game. Other jobs were boring in comparison. It's not like other people actually talk to me. Ghost, your task is to steal that microchip. Contact us when the mission is complete. Ghost, disable the generator and report back. Every mission was just a distraction to keep me from thinking about how boring the next mission would be. But you two treated me like a normal person. It felt like this mission really mattered. Like it was going to actually change my clients' lives. Especially Boogan. It meant a lot to me when he told stories. Like when you two met for the first time. It was so funny. <laughs> he was trusting me with his personal life. No one had done that before. So I was happy working for you. But when I started closing those valves in the labs, I started to feel strange. A torrent of thoughts and ideas I never had before started to flow into my mind. Like an alter ego was trying to talk to me. Trying to make me doubt myself. I guess that means you didn't know about it. But then you found out. Yeah. There's a link between me and that space station. What if I'm not really human? You're not. It scares me just thinking about it. But I have to find out what's going on. So you need us if you want to reach the truth. I can't do this by myself. You can print my body, read the system, hack computers. I can't. The only way forward is to ask for your help. Will you help me? Well, I feel like garbage. I should trust Boogan more often. Ghost, are you sure about this? You're probably not going to like what you find. I'd prefer to face my origins rather than live forever with this uncertainty. I want to know who I am. Then, let's continue? Definitely. Hey. Perfect. Then let's go. 
With any luck, the android will be in the same location you left it. By the way, I owe you one. And we're back. We're back here. Okay, we're back to where we where we left ourselves. Um, and let me just see. I'm just going to see what percentage we moved up to. Yeah. Um. So we're on 89 percent. What are we on now? 97 more with 97 percent. We're getting close. We can't have much more to go. We can't have much more. We're at 97 percent. All right. Previously on Ghost 1.0. And let me just um before I do that, let me just quickly. Correct. I understand. I mean, I'm I'm I don't know. The temperature change, as you said, is, is out. And um, what I was planning on doing, I figured this was only take would only take like about an hour or so to finish. And then when it finished, I would, you know, we could maybe quickly watch it, you know. But um, it's taken a lot longer than I thought it was. But um, I'll pull it down. Nakamura. I'd prefer to face my origins rather than live forever with this uncertainty. All right. I want to know who I am. You can't believe Victor would go that far. Kid okay, so I'm going to um. Oh, and look at the difference! Look at the difference! Right? Look at the difference now! We got this. Fuck, we got our main robot back. We've got everything back. All of our little gadgets. Oh yeah! You know what's coming, fuckers? No, they don't know what's coming. They got pay. Yeah, I mean, I, I, that was the plan. Was I was gonna, I was gonna play this, and when it went off, I was gonna watch it. But I don't know. How long this is going to take, if you know what I mean? I wouldn't have thought it's going to take hours, but um, I honestly didn't expect it to take as long as it has already. But we're we're at ninety-seven percent, so there's not there's not much left, is there? We're almost there. We're almost there. And we know where the boss room is. The boss room is only just is about the boss room is here. This this room here, north, is the boss room, and we've got one two two rooms to go through, and then we're at the boss room. And then that that boss room is probably it, right? And there's a shop over here. We've got 11,000 um, junkets to spend. What, junkets? Or whatever the hell you want to call them. Junkets. We'll call them junkets. Yeah. Can we go in there straight away? What? So what kind of room is this? Oh, can we? we still got one geek thing I haven't found. So where the fuck is the last one, right? That is annoying. I'm kind of bummed that we haven't found all of them. It's got to be in a, the last one's got to be in a hidden, um, in like a hidden area that I've just not got. I've just not um, hidden souls area that I haven't got to yet. Cause yeah, there's the, the boss room is up there. He dies. That's like, oh. All right. So that's the boss room up there. So door opened, and then we got a shop just before the boss room. And what has he got? Oh, he's got. I'm kind of thinking that I should actually. And um, where's it? Where's the nearest? I might go down to that safe there and then teleport to a, a um, I can't even get the safes there. Oh my god. I think if I can, I get in, if we go in and kill the boss or attack the boss and we die, then we lose any, we lose all these credits. So I might as well try to find something, get a couple of upgrades just to um, use them up, right? Yeah, I mean that was kind of unexpected, though, Hamra. I never expected to have levels like those where we had to go. You know, down to earth and um, and rescue him. That's not, you know, I figured when we did all the rooms here, we'd be done. But um, had that little, that little extra there. All right, so we're gonna go down here. Right? Yeah. So this level here has got the save room down the bottom right, and we'll teleport to um, a shop. And which one is it? We teleport to a shop. Um, I got recharge weapons. I want upgrades. Is what I want. Um, upgrade weapon. That one. We got an upgrade weapon. 
Is there an upgrade weapon here? That one, that's the one I need. That one there. So we've got to teleport to that one and then go down, down right. And this is where we can upgrade our weapons to level 4, I think. Um, I'm going to go down one and right one, I think. Go down one more. All right, so we're gonna go up here. Is where it is. All right, shop. Being stuck in some trippers and crap like that gotta make you feel real bad as yes, it does. So twenty hundred we can go Okay, up frogs. So we can reach our shotgun again to level to uh, how many we got? We can get one of each of one of each. And what have we got for weapons? Can I can heavy cannon that shoots a bolt um, causing heavy damage to one turret. Um 108! I might actually maybe I should get that. Because I mean, I got my two. I might get a set of shotgun. What 108? My shotgun actually does. If I upgrade it, it does. Nah, the shotgun will do way more damage if I upgrade that. Because it's um, it's six shots, and each shot is um 40 or 38. So yeah, that's, that's way more damage. Cloaking device. Beam, beam drone cannon, bomb cannon. I don't even know what we're gonna get. So I'm just gonna upgrade the free. <laughs> Upgrade these three of things I got here, so cool. So I've got upgraded my three secondaries, and then we can just um, head back over there and um, and take on a boss. But yeah, so we're back up to like 630 health, and we're doing killer damage compared to um, yeah what we had before. I can remember I got the shield behind me, so if if someone's shooting me shooting me in the back, I've got the shield that's going to protect me. It was here, wasn't it? It was the one of one room just above me, I think. I was just going to save it, make sure. All right, let's do it. I went the wrong way, didn't I? I don't want to go this way. I can't get up there that way. I've got to go to the door the other side. What a noob. It's this one i got to go to. <sighs> so we've got one more, one more boss. There's one more room, one more boss fight, and that's it. We are done. Okay, up and just left. Roll upstairs, that's kind of cool. Roll up and downstairs. All right, let's do this. Ready for this? Um, 